This week, some local radio stations, in partnership with Women Who Care Ministries, helped raise nearly $5,000 in food, gift cards, and monetary donations for dozens of Montgomery Village residents who were displaced by a fire on January 8th at the Cedar Mill Apartments. Sadly, a four-year-old boy died in that fire. We're talking about over 40 um, residents that were displaced and 12 households, so approximately three to four family members in each household that were displaced. And as though that wasn't tragic enough, um, one family lost their four-year-old son, and our heart extremely goes out to that family in this hour. It's my duty as a broadcaster to make sure that I give back. And my thing is right now, I just want to get the word out that we need food, we need money, we need clothes, anything that can help, the, help these families out, because they lost everything. Think about if you lost everything, you have nothing. And there's so many people with big hearts and, and, and are so blessed in this area that they can give back just a little bit. You don't have to give a whole lot, just give a little bit. If everybody gives just a little bit, we'll be able to get these families back on their feet. Montgomery County Council President Craig Rice attended the outreach event and he met with some of the residents impacted by the fire. They're deeply moved by all of the support that the community has uh, really shown uh, in stepping up for all of these families, not, this, not just the Quarshi family, but some of the other families as well. And so it, it was a tremendous turnout thanks to all of the community for all that they did. If you missed this event and want to assist these families, you can still contribute. Visit the Women Who Care Ministries website to find out more.